Ooh, it's raining outside. What's going on, fam? Today is a terribly rainy day out. Overcast is what we're dealing with. We will rise in the moment, yeah. But Jenna's just inside. We are no content today, guys. What am I supposed to do? Benjamin's asleep, gonna be working out later. Oh, actually, something that I saw the other day is a viral voicemail that's going around. Apparently, somebody, during this time that we've been experiencing solar flares that are also known to mess up electronic devices, there's a man in the States that received a voicemail from an unknown number. And it's weird because it, the voicemail, it wasn't a person talking. It was an automated voice recording that said SOS danger, SOS. Started talking about it not being human, whatever it's referring to. It said it, it is dire to evacuate. It is not human. SOS danger, SOS. And so apparently there were well not apparently i heard the voicemail there were a bunch of numbers that followed those numbers apparently were the the exact coordinates to where the malaysia plane went missing now with all of this going on he didn't know what to do so he posted it to, did it did it did, 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 he posted it up to twitter once it was up on twitter it went viral everybody started sharing it then apparently two days after that or a day after that or hours after that i'm not sure of the timeline after the fact of him posting it up and it going viral he then received a phone call from unknown name unknown number he answered they told him to delete it they told him to remove it he started asking questions they hung up the line at this point here he said he was kind of nervous he went outside to have a cigarette and while he was sitting in his car somebody pulled up behind him took a picture of his house and drove off now how credible and how real all of this is is kind of what's up for debate right now in in the uh amongst the the youtubers a lot of people are trying to decipher whether it's real or whether it's just a hoax because people do that but it's everything just co-aligns really well so let me know what you think comment below what you guys think don't forget to subscribe whatever you do hit that subscribe button hit that bell button next to the subscribe button so you can be notified every time we release a new video like this one but that's something that's kind of eerie like who if he received that and it was sent to the wrong number because of the solar flares, now he's getting harassed and apparently he started freaking out. He actually deleted his Twitter account and told people to stop sharing it, to stop messaging him that he was actually starting to, to fear for his life, deleted his Twitter account and nobody's heard. So could it be real? For sure it could be real. Anything can be real. There are so many unanswered questions in regards to the situation. It's hard to believe but with everything going on, where is that plane? Nobody found it and it's okay. Like, I don't get that. I don't understand how a plane goes missing. Almost 300 people, that's the messed up part. There were almost 300 people on board that flight with the, the flight attendants and the flight crew. 300 people. So that leaves to think that, are they alive? Are they on an island? Are they enslaved somewhere? Are they dead? Are they? There's so many unanswered questions that it doesn't make sense. If this was something that, if the president was on that plane, I can guarantee they would not sleep until that plane was found. But now it's about going on to the list of people who were on that plane, I'm willing to go back to the flight list and see who was on it, see who could have been a possible threat, somebody that they may have been trying to focus on or pinpoint. Either way, it's messed up. It just doesn't make sense how it was just dropped. A plane went missing with like a church full of people. Like that's our church has, has what? like 300 people 400 people it's like our whole church disappearing and everyone just being cool with it like ooh, that's weird that's weird but anyways make sure you smash that subscribe button follow along with what we're doing we're gonna go find some content the other day i posted up a video saying if you're bored it's saturday get up and do something i showed a little at home workout that you could do and that was just a little piece of the workout that jason uh, uh what is she I'd consider him a mentor. Whether he likes it or not. Didn't really tell me about this workout. I, sh I saw it on his Facebook. Him and a few clients were doing a workout. So I figured I'd give it a try. Turns out that was only one fifth of the workout. So I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the workout tonight. It's intense. He created it about 15 years ago and it has awesome cardiovascular, awesome strength building tactics to it. It really targets every aspect and it's great. It's something that you guys should give a try. Oh wait, I forgot. Just before I show you guys that workout, I forgot that we had some content. It's gonna be an issue. 
but we will keep you guys posted. We will let you know. You can't smell it through the camera, so you will have to trust me. And with that being said, back to the workout. Now, because I don't have my camera, I was able to go into the basement and check out if everything was cleaned up. Turns out landlord did a good job. He got people in, he got the basement cleaned up, and I was able to train clients. So I trained two clients already. I've been waiting for my third client, but I do not believe that she's gonna show up. So I'm headed back home. We have a meeting with our designer today. So, you guys probably, I'm not gonna show that to you guys. Will not show you that video, unless this video gets a minimum, hmm. What shall we do? We're starting low. If this video does not get 10 shares, nobody gets to see the footage that we are gonna take coming up. We're gonna do our meeting. We're gonna have more clients. We have a bunch of stuff coming up. You guys do not wanna miss out on it. So, 10 shares, that's all I'm asking for. Eventually I'll ask for like a thousand likes or something, something wild. But for now, we're gonna stick with the 10 shares. We're going for 10 shares, guys. It's super simple. Do talk, talk, mama told me. Don't think about yourself, my mama told me. One day your heart will melt, now I'm holding. My heart is in my hands, love will mold it. 